Are we on? Yep. Hello, my name is uh, Al E., shall we say, and I have an invention. It's called the Music Dandy. It's a simple music stand overlay. It does some neat things. It holds uh, your folders, which typically would hold uh, student music, quite a bit of it. It acts like this. You use these rubber bands to uh, make this into a valise type arrangement, which is part of the music dandy. Rubber band number one, they're called handy bands. Handy band number two, and then when you're carrying your music around, it's in here and it's secure and it's safe. Now that's just one aspect of the music dandy. Now if we look over here, you'll see a typical uh, inexpensive music stand. And I'm trying to visualize a scenario here where you would have more than one piece of music up. And we all know how frustrating these stands are when we're trying to do things with them. If the books are very thick at all, you have any, any sizable music on a little stand like this, it just doesn't work very well. If I take the dandy, using dandy, put this aside, and I will take this and open it up. And this is a patent pending product. Right now, the music dandy name is trademarked. If we take the cheap stand, music stand itself, and we're going to set it with the bands, go over the back carefully. Like so, we're going to add one more, like so, then the music dandy becomes something much more useful than the plain stand itself. There are also additional hook and loop strips which can go down here and further secure the base of the stand more for a semi semi uh, permanent operation, something like that. But just like they are right now, it's very easily uh, usable. You can fold it up, take it out, and it just goes right along with the stand. Now we'll show you that stand would barely hold this book before. Now it holds it much more securely. And you can hold stacks of music if you are going to read several things. Let's say got two books. Two books here, we're going to get them both. Work very well. And that's on the cheap, about the cheapest stand you can buy. So it, it makes this much more usable. The stand you see comes in white, but it can be easily painted on one side, black. And, so, and you see on a black stand like this, you could actually have your name, this is just a cheap, typical folding stand, but your name would be printed here, say uh, First Methodist Church, or uh, your, your band's name, the uh, Swollen Heads, or whatever you would want on here. Your name could be put there with just simple lettering from any, uh, any craft store, from Walmart, to sell these letters like that. So the uh, music band, it comes in white, but can easily be painted like that. It's very professional looking on a black stand. It's white to the front, and you can see that even with just these bands attached like this, this unit is quite secure. It will hold uh, quite a bit of music. You saw here, this one, this one is about the flimsiest stand there is. This one's going to hold the music much more stable and bigger stacks with no problem. So as soon as you spend a few more dollars in the stand, the music dandy works great. It also works, uh, here's a little sign. It says, attention all instrumentalists. Your inexpensive but flimsy wire stand can now securely hold all your sheet music, lesson books, etc. Make your stand really handy. Get yourself a music dandy. Kind of proud of that saying. Okay, so here attention all keyboardists. Now you can make all your sheet music really handy when you use the exciting new music dandy. 
what you do with the, the keyboard application. Two of these set on a typical keyboard, a piano, grand piano, upright piano, organ. Um, the band sometimes won't work with the attached uh, normal stand, but when you put two of them together with hook and loop bases here, and I've got this one done with the hook and loop strips which come with the unit, you can have two of those together which will give you 48 inches of music space. It's great for accompanists, people that have to work with a wide uh, selection of music up there and must read, especially if you're uh, trying to do something and you've got a hymnal, this music, another hymnal, can get uh, frustrated if you're reaching down for it. It can all be on these dandies. Okay, and then the music dandy, as I mentioned, the black here, it's just a white one sprayed with any normal uh, two-in-one paint or primer source. This is rust and it works great. And you can color it red, green, blue, whatever you like. All right, and then another thing you can do with your dandy, if you have beginning students, you can actually buy these at, at hobby stores. And then here is a, uh, be a lesson in theory going along with your lesson. If your materials were here, you could refer treble clef, your um, flat sharps, signs, your, this is tough time, you can have whole notes, half notes, quarter, eight, sixteenth. Just as a reminder, what can be done. So this could be left permanently, semi-permanently here. This is kind of a, a stick-on type of music dandy. And they come like this in little sheets. So again, that's, a, that's your prerogative to add anything you like, but the music dandy gives you space to do that with. We have two books here. It's very secure. And you saw that if it's... Uh, this is a plain white stand. If we turn it over here, you can have your name there. Emily Jones or something, and you could color it any color you like. Have your name. Okay, and you've seen this one. That's the black one. Again, name there. Here, we go over to our next use of the unit. Here's a typical music dandy in black. Professional looking this way. This is a, uh, I believe, an on stage stand, which is a pretty good uh, folding unit, which is, I would call semi portable, still kind of heavy to be carrying it along, around. When you place this on here, the black will have this effect from everywhere else. The only nice thing about that is with the, with the large music folders, which so often come for band and orchestras, on this stand, that folder sticks out and is shown. When you have this unit, the folder is hidden. So from the audience perspective, it looks slick. Okay, this is probably one of the best folding portable stands on the market. Still kind of heavy, and it, uh, it's a peak stand. And once again, when you add this to the peak, Music stand, professional looking, nice image, can have, um, you know, it could be a chair, endowed chair position, maybe at an orchestra. I just noticed in a, in a New York Phil, a recent performance, live performance of these stands, their stands look kind of ratty. Um, and I thought this would make, make all the difference on, on, for you know, even a professional organization. So in a nutshell, if you want to make your music stand really handy, you should get a music dandy. Check out my website at www.musicdandy.com. And it is a uh, patent pending product and it's trademarked. So hopefully you'll see it soon on the shelf at a store near you. Thanks for listening.